Capital ships are the lumbering beasts of the battlescape. They're heavily armored, mobile artillery platforms built to take out large-scale infrastructure, dealing massive damage to enemy ships along the way. Many of the ship's systems use the same keybinds and radio menus as their smaller cousins, and can even be flown using the same target and direct control flight modes. However, the default capital ship control mode allows commanders to set up for broadside assaults and can track in on targets without having to change their heading. Okay, so this is what you'll see when you first spawn a destroyer. There are two view modes available, a bridge view and a third person view. The bridge view can work well for zooming in on distant targets, however third person provides a broader view of your surroundings and is most useful in intense combat scenarios. You can use F2 and F1 to toggle between them. Increasing throttle functions the same as before, only the acceleration is much slower in these ships and there's no engine boost available. Let's quickly check our weapons menu. The destroyer starts off with some of its weapons offline, so let's activate the MK5 blasters and MK6 primary guns. As I move away from the station, you can see the view is locked to the mouse movement, which also moves the turret aim reticle, which the turrets are now tracking in towards. Once you've cleared the dock, try turning the ship using W, A, S, D, R, or F. To strafe without pivoting, Use left control in combination with the W, A, S, D, R, and F shortcut keys. To turn the ship in the direction you're currently looking, press and hold the cap ship turn button, spacebar, and the ship will turn towards that new heading. There's also an experimental auto turn system which needs to be set manually in the key binding menu. First, open the options menu and go to the keybinds tab where we'll set a custom keybind for the auto turn function. At the time of this recording, a default has not been selected. Scroll down to the generic flight control section and keep scrolling to the bottom of that category. Set a custom keybind for the cap ship auto turn function and apply and save to close the menu. Now press the key you assigned to activate the auto turn. With auto turn engaged, move the view in a new direction and press the cap ship turn key, space. Using this control mode, you can quickly set a new heading while still maintaining focus on your current target. By holding down the cap ship turn key, you can also change the heading continuously. The destroyer has a unique weapon type, mines. These can be dropped using the V menu. You can deploy mines in two modes, safety lock on, which will launch mines that lock onto nearby enemy capital ships, and safety lock off. They will be dropped without locking and can be used to effectively bomb surface targets or lobbed into enemy stations.